What up, guys? What we up? are back. Thanks for watching. I'm your boy, DeAnthony. I'm my boy, Don, here. Yeah. And we're Break Room Blitz. You guys already know, because you see us every week. We're yeah. every week, so... Yeah. I don't even have to even right. announce us. We're friends. I mean, what's up? Uh, so, um, rules on the, on the channel. If we make you smile or laugh at any point, hit that like button. If we make you think, or we, you know, make you upset, you disagree, go ahead and comment. We will tell you why you are incorrect, okay? <laughs> And if you just want to see our beautiful faces every week, hit that subscription button with that notification bell, alright? Alright. Alright, so, went to go see, what was the it? Peppermint. And we went to the premiere. Peppermint Patty. Let me just say. Sorry. Went to the premiere yeah, we of the show. Premiere, baby. Uh, L.A. Jennifer Garner, she's in this movie. Alright, alright. Uh, we got this uh, new actor, I think, John Galax something. Uh, and That's then all. we got Justin, uh, John Ortiz. Those uh, are the bigger actors. What's it about? So, we got uh, Peppermint is a revenge story, kind of like John Wick. Um, revenge on. story centering on a young mother who finds herself with nothing to lose and is now going to take from her enemies the very life they stole from her, which is her family. This is like a spoiler free synopsis. I know. Her right? daughter and her <laughs> husband gets killed, and now she's going to get revenge. Okay? Yeah. That's what's happening. What, what is that? That was whack. I don't know that was a synopsis. Kind of was that. It's like the cartel straight up did dirty <laughs> on our family. Yeah. Right. So, it's an action movie. Like you said, it's like John Wick. It was pretty much like John Wick. She got John Wicked, okay? She got John Wick. So, <laughs> her, her, her family gets shot up, and now she, you know, loses her mind. She like, I'm about to get these motherfuckers here. Right. And it's, it's on and popping from there. So, yeah. uh, the action, I liked. The story, I liked because mm -hmm. it's like John Wick. Right. I mean, it's, I mean, it's a female John Wick. What are you right. Yeah. I mean, it's cool. It's cool. Yeah. Um, the acting was pretty good. Mm -hmm. uh, diversity, it's pretty diverse. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't. Uh, did you, you guys, if you, you're not gonna know, but Method Man is in here. Oh, random. I was <laughs> super <laughs> random, and I was like, he like picked you up. Yo, detective. <laughs> like, he's like an investigator. <laughs> like, Method Man, what are you doing in this movie? Right. It's like, cameo. no announcement or nothing. No. He's in, like, at the last act and stuff. <laughs> right. So, uh, yeah. I know he's trying to come up. Yeah, he's coming up. I, I appreciate that. I was about to say, no black man in here, though, but then I forgot about him. I was like, oh, yeah, Method Man. Method man. Turned yeah. around and was like, here you go. Yeah. This is what we're working on now. Like, yeah. who are you? Where you come from? <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> this is not just nothing. <laughs> they replace somebody? Did someone get fired and just introduce him? It's kind of like a rap movie video kind of thing when they just have featuring and then they have a random guy. Right. <laughs> yeah. um, so, I mean, overall, I thought that the tactic, cool. her, tactic, her tactics, I thought were realistic. Mm -hmm. um, I thought she definitely made up for Elektra. Oh. I was like, I was like, I don't know. Everybody want to be a, a action star Dude. now. Dude. She already tried, right? But she made up for that for sure. Uh, if I had to rate it, I would probably give it a four out of five stars. There's some Ooh. things that I, you know, did think should have, I guess, been portrayed, especially with the whole, you know, we got John Wick now. So mm -hmm. those type of action movies yeah. is no excuse to, you know, leave certain things out. Right. Um, but overall, I like that. I, I, rewatch value is up there. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not gonna. I, I'm not like I can't wait to go see it again. Right. But if it's on Netflix, sure, I'll watch it again. Watch you know, it. Yeah. I mean, people's getting their ass whooped. So, yeah. and I did laugh, and y'all know I laugh oh, when yeah. people get their ass whooped. Oh yeah, and so, there, there's a lot of <laughs> laughing movies. So right. I, I'm on par with this with you. I'm I'm a big fan of this action. We know we're getting. A lot of these kind of John Wick action movies. The the movie that I can kind of compare this to, because it was a women role, was Proud Mary, and that was kind of mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. low key, like pretty dope to me. Yeah, I like Proud Mary too. Yeah, so I mean, uh, you know, we got these women coming up and doing their own John Wick style movies, which is really if cool. If Liam Neeson's gonna be a goddamn action star, <laughs> so can the ladies. Oh okay? yeah, Liam Neeson's. Yeah. <laughs> um, so. Uh, I, I like the action for sure. Uh, it, it was believable the way that they were uh, choreographing like her whole stunts and everything. Yeah, uh, the, the way she handled the gun herself, uh, the fights, pretty dope. The uh, drama behind it all, it was believable too. You know, it shows her tight-knit family and then tragic happened. Um, yeah, yeah. The gangster dudes, the whole cartel stuff, that was pretty dope. Uh, it was believable. 
I'm starting to see a lot of uh, new faces showing up in different movies. Mm -hmm. um, so, um, yeah, I mean, just more actors coming from bottom up. Kind of cool. Um, and then just the overall tie-in to, like, you know, synopsis of where we went from the start to the ending. It was all cool and, like, had some, like, nice comedic uh, parts in it in between. I, I'm not going to ruin it because it was just good. On um, this video. But on the next one, we will. Discussion. We're going to talk about it. Um, so if I had to rate it, I'm going to give it a 4.5 out of 5. Ooh, yeah, the, the, it, 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 to, to me it was like, it was really dope. It's up there. It's a movie that I would definitely rewatch as soon as like if it hits Netflix, HBO, wherever it is, I'm gonna I'm gonna watch it. It's just gonna be instant play. So. All right. Um, favorite part? Favorite part? Um, yes. Uh, w with uh, without giving too much away, I mean she she's pretty kick ass and what she does like in the piñata uh, factory, um, uh, like. There's these epic action moments, and I think that's up there for. Damn, for it. why you gotta take my shit? That's what I. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn! I guess I got another one. Can I say another one? No, it's my turn. All I'm right. saying all the goddamn <laughs> scenes, okay? Taking it away from me. Uh, <laughs> if I had a favorite part, uh, it would probably be when they're at the house. Oh. Um, she ghost rides the whip. Ghost rides the whip. Oh, dope. I love Pretty that dope. part. Oh, that was great. And yeah. I, I haven't seen that in any movie yet. I haven't seen that in any action movie, I should say, like huh. this. I don't know. I don't think about that. Uh, 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 would you... Uh, mm -hmm. So, Atomic Bond is another, You're right? Uh, I guess, European right. woman star. Mm -hmm. Would you... How would you scale that? Uh, I mean, it's kind of like a different movie. Atomic Blonde was more artsy-fartsy for me. Fartsy! <laughs> it, for me, it was more fartsy. I mean, I didn't care for it. <laughs> um, it just kind of like... It, it was... I don't know. It was it was like kind of, of slow burn. A lot of dialogue, yeah, and yeah. it was more of a spy like drama. You um, had to be like a a, a German like uh, historian, right. To really care with the all that. coming down of the Berlin Wall or whatever. Yeah. I don't know that kind of stuff. So that's why I compared it more to Proud Mary because it was a more fun action like gangster shoot 'em up style movie. Mm. So I can agree with you. I just uh, wanted to kind of throw that in there just so people can get like a, yeah. a gauge. Right. But I'm with you. The Proud Mary is probably where I would put this. Mm -hmm. I might put this one a little bit over just because of the style. Yeah. The style seemed more like John Wick. Yeah, yeah. You know, she's like, tush, tush, tush. you know, she's yeah. giving them headshots like it's yeah. candy. Right. <laughs> and, oh, you yeah. and you yeah. get a headshot, and you get a headshot, and you get a headshot. Everybody gets a headshot. Right, right, right. So, oh, man. Uh, which was pretty dope. You know, it shows, you know, her, her uh, I guess, discipline. Yeah. And her, her craft, you know, learning how to, you know, kill without any mercy. Oh, and not only that, too, but um, the one thing that I do appreciate about uh, this movie and uh, same with John Wick is the damage taken. So they take damage throughout oh, yeah, the movie, yeah, yeah. and it just carries out. Like, they, their, their character doesn't end up just, like, healing and their wounds are gone. No, it right, kind of just like carries. Rock. Not like The Rock. Not well, she kind of was like The Rock, though. Well, I mean... A little bit. <laughs> yeah. I mean... <laughs> yeah. She just... There was some kind yeah. of superhero-esque uh, right. parts in there, but... Uh, for the most part, I mean, you know, she gets stabbed, she gets shot. I mean, she's, like, battling through it, but, like, the damage is still there. So. Yeah, you know, I, I, I appreciate They did try to show that, you know, she would have to push through, you know, some type of struggle. Mm -hmm. uh, but she did end up kind of being like John Wick towards the end. Yeah. Or not John Wick, uh, The Rock. The Rock, yeah. Or Vin Diesel. Vin Diesel, yeah. Or anyone from those franchises. Indestructible. <laughs> right. Yeah. Uh, but... They did show, you know, she had the limp, like especially in the beginning, she had the limp. Yeah, yeah. You know, after she fought that dude in the car or whatever, like, I, I can appreciate mm -hmm. those type of things, but they didn't like stick to it as much as they should have. But mm -hmm. I liked it. Um, I definitely glad that I got to go to the premieres. I one of our first premieres ever. Yeah. Uh, so just being able to look back and see our star actor. Oh, there's Jennifer Garner. Right, okay. she was in the theater. So, yeah. You know, so that was kind of cool. I almost wanted to run up and like. <laughs> right, but then that would be everyone, you know. <laughs> Uh, um, then I get arrested. Yeah, uh, we didn't have to go through like security. Some security, and stuff. yeah. Sorry, guys. That's our review, our non-spoiler review. Check out our discussion. We'll be talking about some actual spoilers, not too much, but some spoilers. Please like, share, subscribe, and comment. All right. All right. All right. Now get out of here. Gotta go. Fuck out of here.